Okay, class, listen up. As leftists, we should feel very disappointed in ourselves. We've had mostly peaceful protests and riots for months now, and we couldn't get anyone in the mainstream media to even blink an eye. We even attacked CNN headquarters, and it was barely a blip on the left-wing media's radar. Contrast that to the right-wingers storming the Capitol, and our achievements pale in comparison. The mainstream media are outraged, and they can't stop reporting it. I know it's not a popularity contest, but I think we can do more to get noticed. Any suggestions on our next course of action? I think we should protest. Well, that's what I'm talking about. No one even notices when we protest anymore. Any other suggestions? I think we should protest harder. You mean you weren't protesting your hardest this entire time? For shame. What would your leftist single mother say? Look, I'm not here to call anyone out, but you need to come up with a way to get noticed. Rainbow flags, pink knitted hats, bigger protest signs, chanting louder. We've already tried all that. Any other suggestions? I think we should protest. Nine, six, eight, one. Our protest can't be undone. One, three, nine, four. Watch as we protest some more. Nine, six, eight, one. Our protest can't be undone. One, three, nine. Okay, class, nine, listen four. up. I did some research about why we're not getting enough exposure. The problem isn't that your protests aren't loud, annoying, or peacefully violent enough. Is it because we haven't set enough trash can fires? No, I believe you set a record for that last summer. Maybe we should break more windows? No, it's not that either. It's because the mainstream media is a leftist institution that doesn't want to expose our actions to the rest of the country because they realize people will be appalled by our behavior. They cover it up by either not reporting it, downplaying it, or using euphemisms like mostly peaceful protest. Honestly, at this point, I don't even know why we protest anymore. The left controls the media, Hollywood, education, big tech, and corporate America. If you think about it, why fight the establishment when you are the establishment?